Hey everybody, I'm Sean. Welcome to another episode of Adventuring Spiders. Welcome back everybody. On today's episode, we are out doing some adventuring once again. Uh, this time we are at the Boyce Thompson Arboretum just east of Mesa, Arizona. Uh, an area where uh, a botanist built a massive area of vegetation, uh, trees, plants. And so we're going to do a little quick tour and we're going to show you guys around. Um, let's get on the trail. Just started the walk here. Just checking out a monarch butterfly hanging out here on the flowers. This is the beginning of the trail. One of the really nice things about this arboretum is they've got areas separated by type so up here we've got the Chihuahuan Desert pretty nicely themed areas here and of course surrounding this area you've also got the traditional Sonoran Desert in the background with all the saguaros and the choyos um, so the natural border of this arboretum which is all off to my right here, is bordered by the Sonoran Desert. We're not even gonna to get to see everything here today. The number of trails that branch off and go in all directions is crazy. And uh, the twists and turns, you can really get lost walking through this place, which is great. Well, here's a different kind of plant that I've never seen before, apparently from native to Baja, California. This is called a boojum tree. And uh, there's a couple of them in here. There's the biggest one right in front of me. Very different looking tree. Check this out, you guys. This is a little uh, sundial. And if you stand on the month, it should tell you the time it is. So I'm gonna stand on November here because it's currently November. And you'll see at the top here, the numbers are all laid out. And if you look right now, it says it is almost 10 o'clock where my shadow is. And it is 10 o'clock. So it's probably about 10, 15 minutes off, but not bad. Pretty cool. A little cactus garden here. All different kinds of cactuses. This is definitely one of my favorite spots here, this cactus garden, and look in the background at the saguaros up on the hill there. Pretty amazing. It's just chock full. So many different kinds of cacti. Right, you guys, I'd say we're about halfway through uh, into the cactus garden here. What an amazing place. Um, just check out these barrel cactuses behind me. came across this here in the garden. This is a mono and a matate, or a grinding stone. You can see where that pebble's been pushed back and forth on that rock to grind plant material. I've also got a man-made reservoir here. They used to water this arboretum. It was built by the gentleman who created this park way back in the 1920s, I believe. And uh, in order to get the water supply he needed, he built a lake. Well, you guys, I might not be fishing, but I found some fish. All right, everybody, so we're at the very back of the park here in the Arboretum, and uh, this house is at the very back here. This is where Boyce Thompson lived. And um, this is kind of the area where he settled and then built this arboretum. Beautiful looking house here back. All right, so you can see the wall of the house just above me here. And so that means we're in the back part of the canyon. And you can see that the arboretum extends down from the canyon in front of me. Uh, that's where we're walking right at the moment. We're going to head down this path 
and uh, head down into this area that's been planted with all these trees. And of course we're surrounded by the nice canyons here. Let's keep exploring. All right, coming down the back side here towards the parking lot. Nice little creek bed here. Of course I looked to see if there was any fish, but I don't see any in this one. And uh, we're gonna go into a denser area of trees here. That's a very cool looking tree. All right, everybody, this is a place called Pistachio Grove. I'm assuming these are pistachio trees. Pretty awesome colors in here. All right, this is a Clevenger house. The neat thing about this was it was built right into the rock face. I don't know if this will pick up on camera. It's pretty dark in here, but this was built in the 1900s and uh, lived in by a family of five. And hopefully what's showing up here is the back wall of this house is all the natural rock, including the roof. Um, and they kind of built the house around it. It's a two room house, a fireplace. Abandoned in the 1920s and was bought by Boyce Thompson when he bought the entire area. And apparently used this for his grandchildren as a playhouse. Pretty cool. All right, we're reaching the end here. This is the uh, palm grove. Bunch of different kind of palm trees. This is where some of the biggest trees in this place are. Now we got a section up in here full of pines. And uh, almost back to the entrance. All right, everybody, that's going to do it from the Arboretum here. We're in the little picnic area that's on the way out. And the interpretive center in the background there. So nice little tour. Hope you guys enjoyed a quick hike around the Boyce Thompson Arboretum. And uh, with that, if you liked the video, smash that like button, hit subscribe. Until next time, good adventuring. Look at that, that is a tarantula hawk moth and that is really cool.